Before we get into the video, I need you guys to do me a favour. Number one, get this video to at least 200 likes. Also comment, let me know your thoughts on the case. So, a gang of friends from Bolton in Greater Manchester took the law into their own hands when Anthony George had fatally bladed 25-year-old Tyron Williamson after being thrown out of a Christmas party. Anthony George was known as someone who liked to drink, especially vodka, and he was also known to never leave his house without a blade, so he was always armed. Now on December 11th, 2021, a group of friends convened at Tyrone's house in Bolton for a session. That means there was plentiful drinks, and there was also smoke. During the course of the evening, an argument erupted between Tyrone Williamson and 42-year-old Anthony George. Tyrone accused Anthony of taking his mobile phone and also money that was in the house. Now Anthony retaliated to the accusation by yelling, watch what happens to you. He was then chucked out of the house. Now the court reported that Anthony George was so drunk that even his partner who had seen Anthony walking down the street could not even recognise him. Again, as Anthony George left the property in Bolton, he screamed, watch what happens next. He also made reference that he was going to target everyone's neck. Now because of the argument, Tyrone went outside despite the fact that Anthony George by this time had gotten into a friend's car. Tyrone says, I'm going to one bomb you and then he reached into the passenger side of the window trying to connect with Anthony. However, that was a fatal mistake. Anthony, whom again always carried protection, pulled out his blade and used it on Tyrone Williamson, striking three times. All three wounds were to the torso, the blow connected with the heart and lungs. Now of course, ambulance and police were called and they soon arrived on the scene and they gave the 25-year-old emergency treatment. He was then taken to hospital but sadly he was pronounced dead a short time later. Now as for Anthony, he escaped from the scene and hid at a friend's house telling people I've just jibbed up my mate. Within 90 minutes, the gang of Bolton men, Brendan Carney, Adam DeSegreen and Jason Wilding, along with a few others, found Anthony with a mate at 8.15pm that same evening. Now bear in mind they had just watched their mate be fatally injured. So of course they were angry, distraught and not thinking straight. One of the men chased Anthony George's friend away while the others dished out their punishment. Anthony George was bladed five times that included the stomach and twice in the back. Hands and legs were also used. While people attempted to phone for an ambulance, Anthony begged them not to call the police. He was then taken to hospital where he was arrested for the M of Tyron Williamson. Now, Anthony George himself spent three weeks in hospital and he was then sentenced to life, told to serve at least 21 years before parole for the crime against Anthony Williamson. Again, he was only 25 years old. Now, as for Tyron's friends that got retribution, Brendan Carney, Adam Deesa Green and Jason Wilding, they were all found guilty of attempted M on Anthony George and they're due to be sentenced at a later date. Condolences. Stay safe. Safe.